welcome students to the next lesson i am cynthia going to teach you how to speak in the present and past each tense has four forms that is simple continu simple continuous perfect perfect continuous in the given table is simple present tense simple present tense is used to express an action that has taken place at present or at the time of speaking we can learn to form sentences in the affirmative negative and interrogative she reads the poem regularly affirmative sentence in the simple present they do not read regularly negative in simple present does she read regularly interrogative in simple present if you try to jumble the given table you can frame wrong sentences for example does they read regularly it's a wrong sentence correct sentence do they read regularly second example do he read regularly it's a wrong sentence correct is does he read regularly third example she read regularly wrong sentence correct sentence she reads regularly present continuous tense is used to indicate an action which is still going on at the time of speaking from the given table we can form sentences in the affirmative negative and interrogative for example we are reading the book on time affirmative in present continuous tense they aren't reading the book negative in present continuous tense are they reading the book interrogative in present continuous tense again if we try to jumble the given table for example is i reading the table it's a wrong sentence correct sentence is he she it reading the table reading the book present perfect tense when we use present perfect tense we can we use past participle form of the verb present perfect tense is used to express an action completed in the past linked with the present the table help us to make sentences in the affirmative negative and interrogative i have eaten delicious food for lunch affirmative it's a right sentence if i say i has eaten delicious food for lunch it's a wrong sentence the right is i have negative sentence they haven't eaten the raw food it's a correct sentence suppose i say they hasn't it's a wrong sentence interrogative sentence has she eaten the baked food it's a correct sentence if i try to say have she eaten the baked food it is a wrong sentence
let us learn about present perfect continuous tense present perfect continuous tense is used to emphasize the continuity of an action that has begun in the present and is still going on at the time of speaking she has been reading since afternoon the sentence sentences affirmative in present perfect continuous sense they haven't been reading the poem for 15 minutes negative in present perfect continuous tense have they been reading for for too long interrogative in present perfect continuous tense students remember remember not to jumble up the given table forms of simple past tense students let's learn to speak in the past the past tense is used to express an action that has been completed the table help us to frame sentences in the affirmative negative and interrogative you ate some rice and vegetable curry affirmative in the past tense second example she did not eat biscuits for lunch negative in past tense did you eat some rice and vegetable curry for lunch interrogative in past tense past continuous tense is used to express an action going on at some time in the past from the given table you can learn to frame sentences in the affirmative negative and interrogative for example mr mehta was eating his lunch when the bell rang affirmative in past continuous tense i haven't i wasn't sorry i wasn't eating all by myself negative in past continuous tense were they eating in the class as they interrogative in the past continuous tense past perfect tense past perfect tense is used to describe an action that was completed before another action took place past perfect tense affirmative negative interrogative sentences can be formed from the given table we had spoken to my boss as they affirmative in past perfect tense they hadn't spoken to you on time about the excursion trip negative in the past perfect tense had i spoken to you earlier that day interrogative in past perfect tense past perfect continuous tense past perfect continuous tense is used to show an action that has been going on before another past action past action the given table can guide us to make affirmative negative interrogative sentences for example i had been speaking to all the people before the election affirmative in past perfect continuous tense he had not been speaking well to his friends since a year negative in past perfect continuous tense had he been speaking about the trip 
before the storm interrogative in past perfect continuous tense thank you students